All right, guys, so me and Sunny Bear are lost. Everything looks the same. We're on all these weird trails, and I found out the only way to go home is this way here. So we're slowly going to approach through the rough terrain of the Walker Tiki Trails. All right, as Sunny Bear slowly approaches, he knows the trail could get rough and dangerous. So what he does is he makes sure everything's good first. Whoa. Just because Sunny Bear can fit through there doesn't mean I can fit through there. I'm 220 pounds heavier than Sunny Bear. Sunny Bear finds his way through. Oh, he goes through the water, but I can't go through the water. I must step on boulders. Sunny Bear makes it look so easy as he runs through the rapid waters of the rough Colorado River. Whoa, Sunny Bear has skills. Hopping from rock to rock. Uh-oh. Derek's out of space. He climbs on the island. Oh, what must he do? No, Sunny Bear's speeding up fast. I'm doing this all while holding an $800 vlog camera. Oh, wow. Hold on, Sunny. We're stuck here. Good thing I have super long legs. All right, Sunny. Wait a minute. This looks like a rough terrain. All right. We're at a fork in the road. What shall we do? Must I go up where well, there's no extensive way down? Or must Sunny Bear go swimming in the water for hours? I think we have to go this way, Sunny. The trails outlasted us. We must fall back. Come on, Sunny Bear. We must fall back to easier ways. Okay. There's no easier ways that way. Come on, I changed my mind. Let's go. All right, guys. I'm thinking about going through here. But that's a lot of bushes. That's a little too deep because I'm wearing shoes. Might have to go up here, try and jump off. Then again, I'm not Michael Jordan. How am I now? Oh, Sunny Bear found a way. Did he found a way? Even that way looks hard. I will let Sunny Bear decide. We must call in the helicopter. Thank you for tuning in to Lost. But we cannot make it. Wait. My associate said he found a way. As we trail back a slight bit, Sunny Bear has a way. Whoa. Sunny Bear wants to go swimming so bad. Save yourself, Sunny Bear. I'm not going to make it through the rough terrain trails of Honowakatuku. The name changes every second because I cannot say it the right way. Sunny Bear. Save yourself, Sunny Bear. Somebody has some Takis. Maybe we can split them and we'll live for another day. Whoa. These bushes are, whoa. Your owner almost failed, Sunny Bear, and you keep on going. I see how you are, Buster Man. As I get a text message, the whole time I realize I've had a phone, and I could have been phoned for help. But I'm too desperate to get out of the islands of Wanatokatuku. As Sunny Bear doesn't mind me alone, I'm scared out of my shivering booty crack. I'm gonna phone for help. We're not gonna last out here. The sun's settling down. And the bats out here and the lions and holy shit. Big ass motherfucking bee. He almost attacked me. I must phone for help. Oh wait. Here comes our plane now. Do you see the plane from afar? Do you see him way over there? That must be our plane there. But it's an airplane and there's no landing course over here. So I feel like me and Sunny Bear are going to have to run through the bushes of Hanawakatuku. As Sunny Bear gets impatient and he circles around me because he's getting hungry and he might, oh, I'm too zoomed in. As you can tell, I have a catfish mustache and I have not shaved for weeks because apparently there are no razors or CVSs inside the jungle. As I stepped in a cold water, I feel like my toes are going into an Antarctica freezing shock. Even though I'm in the desert and it's extremely hot. I don't know where I got that ballistic idea from. Whoa, as I nearly missed the water. Sunny Bear has gas, apparently, because I smell like somebody has farts out here in the Wanapakatuku Jaku jungle. Sunny Bear does a Harlem shake while I'm getting attacked by bumblebees breaking through the pierced ledges and the fierce canyons of island Wakasakamiki. And I, oh, watch out for this terrible bush here. Oh, I almost got hit by a bushwhacker. All right, now I'm getting tired. 
I might look for a canyon to lay in and start a fire with two sticks with my feet because my feet are hot and musty. I found a way. Come on. Come on, bear. I found a way to Island Wanakakutuku. Come on, boy. Whoa. That's anybody that dives through bushes in desperation to find his home. Let's go. You go first. Oh, okay. I see you're stronger than me. Whoa, I'm in quicksand here. Come on. We are here stuck. The trail's over there, as you can see. But we are stuck in here. All right, guys. I want to start doing my giveaways in case anything happens to me. I want to let everybody know, uh, Sunny Bear, if he gets alive and I don't make it, Sunny Bear, you can have all my doggy bones. And yes, I have doggy bones. Please don't say the jokes for last. All right. And I want to give away my sock drawer to anybody who hates my big ass feet because my feet are size 15 and I'm only six foot tall. Something's wrong there. As we continue to go to the wicked trails, I must say, Sunny Bear runs the course like it's his own and he knows exactly where he's going. Uh oh, Sunny Bear finds prey. He found us some food. Looks like we'll be eating rabbits. I guess not. Sunny Bear is on a diet, which is good for him, but terrible for me. The trail appears. Ladies and gentlemen, we are saved. I want to thank you for all your support and going through this journey with me. Now we just have to go this way and we are almost back at home. Ladies and gentlemen, please never get lost in these trails of Hanawakatukataka because you will get eaten by a Tukataka and then you will never make it back to your Homakasa. Ha! Now I gotta take a masa. Ha! Sunny Bear! Sunny Bear just had a bath. Uh, and I gotta get my nether bath now. Look at his feet. Uh oh, who you smell? Who you smell? Who you smell, boy? Uh oh. Sunny Bear's onto something. We might end up in another trail of Hukutakatiki. 